Hi, it's Ren from Spirits of Fashion, back with some fashion talk for you today. I'm actually filming, well, there's a thunderstorm storm going on, so it's pretty cool. Um, it's raining, and of course, we've had plenty of that up here in Vermont. And luckily, we didn't get flooded in our area, but nearby areas did, unfortunately. Um, they're still cleaning up uh, from all of that. But today, I just thought I would um, talk about something interesting based on a movie that I just went to see the other night. We saw Oppenheimer about J. Robert Oppenheimer, who was, quote, the father of the atomic bomb. And while it's a very depressing topic, Vogue came out with an article about what they're calling Oppenheimer core. So Barbie came out, of course, the same day, and they have Barbie core. And then Vogue had an article that said, forget Barbie core, Oppenheimer core is all the rage. So I thought it would be fun to go into my crazy closet and pull out a few of those um, inspired looks. So one of them that I uh, based it on was Givenchy's Military, and I'll put pictures up here and videos for you to see as well. Um, so the military part of the Oppenheimer, of course, it's all about military, it's about um, working men in classic suits as well, and the working man in general. So I based it on those three concepts, those three looks. So um, I found a jacket that I ordered years ago from Pyramid Collection, and it looks like a, a green navy, I'm sorry, green army jacket, but the detail behind it makes it completely unique. So I tried that on with a pair of khakis, and that's what you're seeing on the screen. Um, so that was the military look that I based on uh, Givenchy's look from the article. And then there was a classic look and I used as inspiration Alexander McQueen's um, wonderful image of a classic look with a crazy belt. So I tried to imitate that look. I have a lot of those long suit Sorry, jackets. I had a man's uh, <laughs> shirt on that I had found at a yard sale for $5 and it's vintage. And my fake um, wannabe Doc Martens. Uh, and I thought it was fun because I, I have these really long black trousers that I thrifted a while ago. And it just sort of suits that whole mood uh, about, you know, the classic suit, no pun intended. So that was based on Alexander McQueen's look. And then finally, the Working Joe, as the article mentioned, was based on, and I have to look at his name, Feng Chan Wang. Um, I used to be much more up to date when I was teaching full time, but um, that designer came out with this, one of the looks was just full on denim. So I have this jumpsuit that I had gotten thrifting once and I wore the jumpsuit with a jean shirt, as you can see underneath it. So, and with the same boots and it just kind of gave the feel of the Oppenheimer aesthetic. Um, now, the acting in the movie have to give it a plug because there were a lot of stars in that movie including Matt Damon including Rami Malek who of course won an Academy Award for his portrayal of Freddie Mercury in Bohemian Rhapsody he had a smaller role in this film but uh, very very well done and I suggest it for anyone who's interested in the history of that period the 1940s World War II so this is a shorter video today but I just wanted to mention that article that came out in Vogue because I thought it was so interesting and just basing any look from your closet, just pull out what you can get that you already have that is inspired by some of these. Like I said, I had this, this green jacket for many years, had this long suit jacket for the other look, and then this happened to have this full on denim jumpsuit that I just added a jean shirt to. So it was a full denim outfit. You can do that too. If you don't have any of those items in your closet, it's a great excuse to go thrifting and looking for them because it really will take us into the fall. A lot of these looks are more fall looking than they are summer, that's for sure. Uh, I suspect the long awaited September issue of Vogue that'll be coming out soon will probably have some of these looks in there, hopefully. So that is my video for today. It's very short. We're working on some changes on my Spirits of Fashion website. I'm still doing um, events, which of course, any of you who are signed up for my newsletter, which you can find on my website, spiritsoffashion.net. When you sign up for that, you can see all of the places that I am doing events in the near future. 
and what the topics are as well. So please feel free to visit that website and we're making some more changes to it as we speak to make it even better. And I'd love to have more people sign up for that newsletter because it just gives just some bites of information about what's going on. And it's my passion sharing some of the styling tips with you, some of the crazy outfits I find thrifting and more about fashion history as well. So I hope you're all staying safe where you are and healthy and are enjoying the summer. And don't forget to like and subscribe and please ring the bell so you'll know when the newest videos come out. Thank you so much for watching. Leave a comment below if you've heard of Oppenheimer Core, if you like that idea, if you've seen the movie, I'd love to hear your thoughts on it. So thank you so much for watching again and I will see you in the next video. Don't forget, Style never dies. Bye.